Hey everyone, so I just got this filter for the aquarium that I will make the waterfall with. The next thing I got is this piece of grapevine wood and I will be boiling this to help it sink and get rid of all the stuff in it that might make the water dirtier, like browner, you know. The next thing I have is a Lowe's bucket to do water changes in and just a plain bucket. I have this aquarium silicone and it's just leftover from when I made this because I really didn't even need it because we just like made a slot for the glass instead of using this but I'm gonna use this to make the like box that the dirt will go in for the pothos and then use it to make the waterfall rocks stick together yeah I'm also gonna show you some stuff that I already had or didn't have to buy so I can just show you every single thing I got for this so the first thing is this and I already had this it's a little bit old a little bit crusty scratched up but it's cheaper than buying a new one so it'll be fine and I won't even have to use this this much I'm probably just gonna use it whenever I um like get them the fish and stuff ready to go in there like get the water so they have a little bit more space than just a plastic bag while I'm dripping the water the next thing is just these pebbles that are pretty big and we have these from and we had a bay of fish and then I also have these rocks and we it's just a bag of rocks and I have a lot more rocks that I had that I collected but then my friend accidentally took them home with her so we have to give those back sometime but I have a lot more rocks than this to make the waterfall with and I just have this terracotta pot which can just be used as a hiding spot and I need to clean this a smaller terracotta pot that I was thinking maybe the shrimp could use or something since it's so cute and tiny. And then I also have this broken brick, which is just like kind of like a little tunnel and just looks like that. A fish in it, and I probably won't use this except for whenever I um, have to get the fish into the new aquarium. So today I got some more things. I got this black background to go on the back of the I aquarium. I also got this siphon and gravel washer, and it just looks like that. Hey everyone, today I'm going to be showing you everything I got so far for the aquarium, and this is going to be most of everything. Um, I have the light, I already put it in here. It looks like that. The next thing I have is some black sand, just looks like that. So we will straddle them stuff which is for the plants and the next thing i have is a power strip for all of the stuff that i have to plug in and this one is can have a timer on it and this one is it doesn't have a timer so that's nice i got this giant thing of food which i thought would be a lot smaller but it came a lot bigger test strips to test the water before i put any animals in feeder thing which i can just Put stuff down the tube and then it'll go into the bowl. I got some shovel wood and that's supposed to be good for shrimp. Smaller slide you had to like buy two of to get it and that ended up being more expensive than the big one and this is a lot bigger than I thought it would be but like yeah I got some water conditioner stuff. Very big <laughs> for the shrimp and the snails. The African dwarf frogs. Kid Oppa leaves. I'm not sure if that's how you say it. And those are supposed to just be good for the shrimp. And a beta fish is probably good for the Thermometer to make sure the water is the right temperature. Water heater. Some food for the shrimp. A very tiny tunnel. Beta log. Even though I'm not sure if Nina did it yet. But I still thought it was cute. But it's a lot smaller than I thought. Which is fine. But that's what that filter. Is the last thing I got is some Tetra Safe Start Bobble Moss. And it came in a bag at first, but I had to put it in some water before I set up the aquarium. So I didn't die, but that's what it looks like. And yeah, I will see you when I get some plants or my fishing cat comes in, because I think that's all that I ordered that hasn't came in yet. And then I have to get some plants. And then I think I'm done. And some like bloodworms and brine shrimp and frozen foods like that but yeah I, my little fishing cat came in hey everyone 
So, um, I got some plants from Petco, and I'm just gonna show you those. So, I got this one. It's tiny. Like that. And then I got some moss balls. And there's two of them in there. I got this plant. You can't really see it. It's kind of foggy. But it just looks like that. And that kind of looks weird, funny looking. Like, yeah. And then I got another one that's just kind of long. That looks like that. And I got these. I think they're like lily pad ish things, bulbs. I'm not sure how well they're gonna grow, but they look really cool, so I got those. And I also got this plant that I thought looked nice. And then I got, this isn't live, but I got a beta leaf, and it also works for African dwarf frogs, and I might get a beta fish, so the, the beta fish can also use it. And yeah, that's everything I got. And now I'm gonna set up his aquarium in that video should be coming out the week after this one so stay tuned for that everyone so um i got a new filter because both of mine broke because you weren't supposed to use them with sand and i didn't know that so they died and we couldn't get them to turn back on so i got a new filter so it's a sponge filter this time got that then the tubing then these things to hold that and then the air pump and yeah